So the last roundabout with the Olympics, I felt like I was just trying to get healthy enough every single day to be able to even have the opportunity to compete for the Olympics. When I first got hurt, you know, obviously the first thing that runs through your mind isn't how much it hurts, but you know, what you're losing from that injury. Swing more around this way to see more of your face. I think the biggest takeaway I got from that was there's always a silver lining to every bad incident. So even though I got hurt and broke both my ankles, I was able to come back and do more on pommel horse and rings. And that was my ticket to make the Olympic team that year. Where this go about, it's been a four year process and it's a lot more focused on performance and execution. And I think that's gonna be the difference between the 2016 Olympics versus London.